Well, what was nearly trash turned out to be an astounding treasure. Works of art uncovered in the garage of a Long Island bungalow turned out to be worth as much as $30 million. CBS 2's Weijia Zhang has more now on this beautiful find. Arthur Panagian, probably an unfamiliar face and name in the art world on par with de Kooning and Rothko and Pollock. An exhibit on the east side features many of Panagian's pieces, but to truly appreciate his work, you have to understand where it came from. As soon as I came into this building... This garage, part of the Bellport bungalow Thomas Schultz bought in 2007, inside... It was lying here in this room on the dirt floor. It refers to Panagian's entire collection of paintings, 7,000 of them. A lot of the works were wet, they were moldy. A hidden treasure worth... 30 million dollars in the retail market. Million. Million. Panagian lived in the house for the last 25 years of his life. The family asked Schultz to dump the art, but... It was just um, something that needed to be saved because it was someone's passion. So where do you store 7,000 pieces of art? Believe it or not, most of them are right here inside this small storage space in the back of Schultz's gallery. The paintings are inside these archival boxes. Some are standing alone. All of them are climate controlled to preserve the work. This is a completely new discovery of an artist who is utterly unknown. Panagian, a pioneer in the comic book industry. He earned a bronze star in the army, but never publicized his art. We feel that Panagian found us because he, met, he might have recognized that we were willing and capable of maybe bringing his works to, to the spotlight. Now Schultz's life's hobby, carrying on another man's life's work. In Bellport, Weijia Jang, CBS 2 News. Good thing you didn't throw them away, huh? Well, you can see the pieces in person at the Fuller Building Gallery at 57th and Madison.